There's a cognitive bias called the illusion of explanatory depth. And what it is, is we tend to overestimate our knowledge of things, but when we have to explain or teach that knowledge in detail, we find that we know very little on the subject. We're kind of like this teenager who thought he was just jumping into a puddle. He thought it was simple. He thought it was easy. He could do it. He didn't know the depth of what he was jumping into. We are just like him. We overestimate our depth of knowledge on the subject until something forces us to come to terms with how little we actually know. When it comes to testing, most people view it as a simple and an easy thing, and they overestimate their knowledge in being able to test well, and they underestimate the depth of knowledge needed to be able to create a successful testing program. They jump in, and they find that the depth is much deeper than they thought. I've seen many companies tell us that they had the testing strategy covered, and that they didn't need help in that department. All they needed was a tool expert. I would then see these companies who had such profound strategic knowledge turn out some of the worst tests, receive very little ROI, and create a very poor, mediocre testing program. These people may have been very strategic in their own right, but they didn't understand the theories behind good testing. They overestimated their own depth of knowledge, and they underestimated what it takes to build a successful testing program. I want to help you be a successful testing expert by teaching you the theories that the true experts use. You may already know a lot, and you may be very strategic in your own right. What I want to do is help you learn the testing theories so you can better apply them in context, get success even faster, get ROI, and receive more profits.